Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode of 15 Minute Builds. And in today's episode, we are going to be doing another design episode where we come up with as many designs of a thing as we can in the 15 minutes that we have. And today, we've done path designs, we've done roof designs, today we are going to be working on window designs a little bit. So, without further ado, actually, you know what, before we do this, let's, let's set up just a little bit. Um, let's just go ahead and lay out a quick wall for us, for our first one. Like so, there we go. All right, without further ado, let's go ahead and get right to building. I'm going to put 15 minutes on the clock starting right now. So, first thing we're going to want to do is we're going to want to grab some glass. And we'll probably want some stairs as well. Now, one thing that you will see uh, sometimes in Minecraft builds that makes me cringe a little bit is when people do this for their windows. Right? No, don't do that. Do this instead. Use panes. It looks so much better. It looks so much better. Just you see the, the slight depth. So much better than it would be otherwise. But let's do this. So we've got this wall, and this wall is six wide. Let's actually make it an odd number. And let's do maybe some windows like that, okay? Then we can make those look a little bit better by just putting some planks in, and then we'll just pretend that the roof is up here, right? Get the idea. And that's our first design. Super, super simple but way better than just a wall with some glass blocks in it. In fact, we're, gonna, we're not going to use glass blocks anymore for the rest of the video. So, real, real simple wall design, right? Then we'll go one, two, three, four, five. Each of these wall sections, I think, will be five wide, uh, just for consistency's sake, right? And we're going to use pretty much the same building materials, I think, for all of them as well. So we'll do that. Now, let's do something a little bit different. Let's go with maybe like a big, like a picture window, if you will. And... This time, let's maybe grab some spruce wood, and let's kind of section this area off a little bit. In fact, let's actually take the window up to here instead, and we'll maybe lay down some oak stairs like this, like so, and maybe we'll put some grass in front, and grab some oak slabs, and just kind of lay it down like that, right? And then we have kind of this little planter box. I don't really care for that, actually. I'm looking at this, and I'm not really loving it. Um, maybe we'll do something like this instead. There we go. Right, just kind of frame out the window like that, and then maybe this thing comes across like so, and we can maybe put those down and around like that. And we could even do kind of the same thing with the logs going here. Put a stair and a stair. That kind of frames it out. That's not bad. And then here, maybe we put slabs in front. So we get kind of this window like that. And it's, it's a little bit more ornate, uh, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. We could even put some buttons up in here, right? Uh, or buttons like this as well. Just span some buttons around it. Um, that's a very ornate window, probably a little bit too much. So, but you know, we can do something similar to that. So let's move on to the next one. Uh, we'll go one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And go like that. Okay. Let's go back to our two high windows, and we'll do something like this. Then once again, we're going to want to frame this out, so we'll use our spruce logs to kind of do that. There we go. And we'll kind of frame it out that way. And then maybe we'll go with some spruce fences, and we can kind of put some fences along the sides here, right? And then maybe we put a log like that and like that? No, maybe not. Maybe we put some cobblestone 
No, don't really care for that either. Maybe, maybe we do this. Maybe we just bring this across like that. And do something real simple. That looks all right. That doesn't look too bad at all. We can put some buttons in there if we want. And we could put fences down the middle as well, but I don't think that's necessary in this case. So we'll do that, and maybe here we could lay some little feet down, right? Something along those lines. Now, another option for windows, now that you've gotten a couple ideas from that, I hope, just ideas of kind of framing it out and adding some detail, Another option for windows is to kind of do it this way. We could add a really nice kind of window shape here. Let's actually bring this up a little bit higher. There we go. We could add kind of a nice window shape if we do this the right way. All right, so you see... Eh, just kidding. Let's do it like that. Or maybe like this. Oop. Oh, come on. There we go. Yeah, that's not bad. That gives us kind of the shape we're looking for. So we can do kind of this nice uh, sort of um, arched window, which I think looks pretty good. I like it. However, the problem with this is that if you put a glass pane here, it's not going to connect properly. So I know, I know we said we weren't going to use glass blocks anymore in this build, but I changed my mind. We're going to. Uh, let's grab some colors. Maybe we'll go white, blue, and cyan. And you can maybe kind of come up with a little bit of a design. Nothing super fancy or, uh, you know, anything along those lines. Just essentially we're just kind of filling in the space. In fact, let's do this. Let's, let's make it an actual design. Um... We can go maybe like that. And then you can kind of see we've got this sort of, ooh, wow, the sun, the sun and that are not getting along very well. Uh, but long story short, you can work in some detail if you use glass blocks, but you use them behind the window like that. And then it still doesn't look totally bad. Um, to kind of build on that, We'll do basically the same thing here. Uh, let's actually scoot this over a little bit. And one, two, three, four, five, right? That's, yes, good. All right, let's grab some stairs. Stair, 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 block, block. Okay. Oh, that's way too short. <laughs> that's way too short. Try again. There we go. Stare, stare. Okay, so we'll do essentially the same thing we just did as far as the window behind goes, but then we'll detail it out a little bit more. So maybe we'll take some stone bricks and some cracked stone bricks, and we'll kind of lay out a bit of a framework around it and just kind of connect this up like so. And maybe we'll put a chiseled there and there, and a chiseled here and here. So we get something kind of going like that. And then we could even take some stone brick stairs and some stone brick slabs. And maybe we'll go like that. And then down here kind of connect the opposite, and we could even take some cobblestone walls and put those in right here. And you can see it's the same window, it just looks a lot better like this. Uh, we could even put some stairs to kind of stick it out a little bit. You know, there's a lot of things you can do with this. Maybe we'll do this. There we go. And then, you know, this would be another... This would essentially be a wall section that would repeat uh, over and over and over and over again. So we do something like that. I think on the other one we had 
yeah, we had that extra little bit of depth being created right there. Uh, and then furthermore, to build on that even more, we could take spruce planks and build them up here like that. And then we've got the spruce, but it's kind of hiding behind the other stuff, which I think is actually kind of a good thing. Um, that would probably look better with oak, though, just looking at it. I think the spruce is a bit too much. Yeah, the spruce is too dark. The oak, the oak logs look much better. There we go. So we do something maybe like this, and we get kind of a window design there. Okay, now, let's move on to over here. Let's just clear all this out. Let's grab our stuff. And maybe we're looking for kind of like a, a broken window, right? So we get something like this. And we'll take a little bit of jungle wood, or jungle planks, and just kind of mix those into the frame a little bit. Um, do something like that, maybe. Then we'll take some panes, and you can kind of do some cool things with panes uh, if, you, if you want. If you want to kind of knock some stuff out, you can kind of do something like that. And we get this kind of broken window effect. And then to build on that, we can take some cobblestone stairs and maybe kind of mess up the roof a little bit. You know what I mean? So you get this kind of dilapidated, uh, broken building feel. Oh. Something kind of like this, right? And that gives you this kind of broken window, which is kind of cool. I kind of like it. Um, jungle. And then we'll do, you know, kind of maybe something similar again. Just kind of giving it that worn, beaten up feel as well, which... I think is a good thing. Uh, another option for windows is to do kind of a framework. Uh, let's go, let's go four in between for this, just so there's some room for us to work with. We'll grab some dark oak. Oh, I should have used, ah, uh, you know what? I need spruce. How am I doing for time? Oh, wow, it's 12 minutes already. Okay. Well, let's go quickly, I guess. We'll have to build quickly. That's fine. Uh, so we maybe do something like that and connect these planks up, right? We go like so. And we'll kind of frame the area out like that. And then behind it, we'll go back to the oak. Like this and knock out a window, put our glass panes in there like that, or maybe we don't do that. Maybe we do this instead. Maybe we go here is our window. I think I like this. Yeah. Yeah, we'll put our window here instead so it kind of sticks out a little bit. And then we can put some 13 minutes. Man, time's flying. We can put some fences down there. And maybe some dark oak slabs on top of that. Because, you know, the dark oak and the, um, and the other thing blend pretty well. And then maybe we add just a little line right here. and uh, Or we could put some flower boxes or something like that. Speaking of flower boxes... Let's do one with flower boxes real quick. Well, we got... This will be probably the last one before I run out of time. So we'll do something like that, right? And right here... We'll put down some grass. Grab ourselves some super awesome trapdoors. Like so. That looks good. Then we'll grab... Some spruce logs, build them up, and where does this feel for height? I feel like this should be about there. Yeah, that looks good. 
And maybe for the maybe for the walls, we do walls like this. In this one, we use fence posts instead of glass. And we can just put some flower boxes in, like so. And then maybe up here, we kind of frame it out like that. So there you have it, guys. I'm going to call this one done at 14 minutes and 30 seconds. We got a whole bunch of different window frame designs. I hope you got some ideas from this. Um, some of them obviously better than others. And obviously, uh, this is really more about just giving you kind of ideas and inspiration than it is about giving you a super awesome window design that you can copy to all of your builds or anything like that. So there you have it. But guys, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I do appreciate it. It really helps out my channel. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. There are links in the video description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll definitely see you next time.